Oh, you made it. Come on in. Welcome to Terrebonne Fine Arts Guild Downtown Gallery. I'm Karen Kelly and I am an artist. I always felt that as long as it wasn't work, I was fine. If, if it became work, I wanted to quit. <laughs> it's, I just enjoyed the journey. Helen was awesome. Uh, I started in oils for about four years, and then I started taking watercolor classes. I'd go one day for oil, the next week I'd go for watercolor. Uh, Helen was great in that she went to a lot of workshops uh, in the region, and she would come back and teach us whatever she learned. And I feel that that has really increased my knowledge, you know, a lot quicker than, than normal, I guess. The other thing, she had classes first and third Wednesday, and second and fourth. I went to every one. I'm, I'm an adventurous person when it comes to art. Uh, I usually start off with what if. If I do this, what's going to happen? And so you, I just gravitated from one media to the other. Uh, I, had, I have several close friends in New Orleans uh, that are artists and they were doing pastel so I figured well let me try. I mean for the longest time pastel was not considered a, a, a medium of choice for most anybody. Uh, everybody gravitated to the oils and watercolors. Plain air is French for painting outside. It has become a national movement. I've attended two plain air conventions. We're on our seventh one this year. Last year most of these paintings were done in Santa Fe area where I attended the, the convention. Two years before I had gone to Tucson, Arizona for the convention and the entire focus of the, the convention is plein air and we have about a thousand artists from the, from the nation that attends this convention and we go out on location and paint and it's awesome. Follow your heart, paint what you like, paint what you know, uh, use your own photographs. Everything that is printed is under copyright and copyright infringement, you can get in a lot of trouble. So your best bet is to either go on location, set up still life on your kitchen table, uh, take, go out and take photographs and paint from photographs if you can't be out on the location. But do not copy. If, when you study art, you begin to appreciate your surroundings. So I'm an advocate for having art in schools because, you know, you, you walk around, you see, oh, well, you know, there's the sky, there's a tree there. But until you start trying to duplicate that, you really understand just how great God's creations are. It, it gives you an appreciation of everything else in this world.